Hey designers, in this video, we are going to create this building jumping wiggle effect in After Effects quickly and easily. So, let's get started. This is the picture that I'm going to be using, and I have already placed it in After Effects. Now, what we need to do first is remove the Eiffel Tower from this picture. To do that, you can use any app you are comfortable with, but I'm going to use Photoshop for this step. So, in Photoshop, I'm going to make a selection around the Eiffel Tower. Once the selection is done, I'll use the Content Aware tool to remove it from the picture. Once that's done, I'll save the edited picture. Now, back in After Effects, I'll import the edited picture and drag it below the original one in the timeline. This will act as the background while we animate the original image. Next, I'll select the original picture and, using the Pen tool, I'll create a mask around the Eiffel Tower. I'll make sure to outline it properly so that only the tower is separated. Now, to refine the mask, I'll press M on the keyboard, expand the mask one property, and adjust the mask feather. Increasing the feather value will help in softening the edges so that there are no harsh cuts. Once the masking is done, I'll pre-compose this layer. I'll select the option Move All Attributes and then hit. OK. With this pre-composed layer selected, I'll go to Effects and Presets and search for the CC Bended effect. I'll apply this effect to the layer. Now, I'll adjust the Bend Start and Bend End values. First, I'll set the end value so that the effect starts from the top of the tower. I'll set the start value at the point where I want the bending to begin. Now, to animate the bend, I'll click on the stopwatch next to the bend property and set a keyframe. I'll start by setting the bend value to 48. Then, I'll move the playhead 20 frames forward and change the bend value to negative 48. This creates a wiggling motion. To make this motion repeat continuously, I'll hold Alt on the keyboard and click the stopwatch next to the Bend property. In the Expression Editor, I'll type Loop Out Parenthesis. Inside it, write Ping Pong Inside Quotation Marks. This expression makes the bending effect loop back and forth, creating that wiggling building effect automatically throughout the animation. And that's it. The effect is done, and now we have a jumping, wiggly movement on the building. I hope this video was helpful. If you liked it, make sure to hit the like button, leave a comment, and don't forget to subscribe to Ace Designs for more content like this. Thanks for watching.